uh, Fair. Here's a horse to you. However, I'll never let you leave this ranch. Oh, yeah? Okay. No, 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 wait, 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 Golden, wait, wait, wait. Go back, stay, go in, right in front of it, like, stand right in front of it. No, wait, 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 no, not run towards it yet. Back up, good, get a good <laughs> backup distance from Jesus it. Jesus Christ, Jesse is so... <laughs> Stop rearing! Epona, come on. Stop! Epona! No, back up. I back, just, I'm go trying straight to... Breathe. Breathe. Okay. Breathe. Breathe. When you're in front of the front gate. Okay. Back up as far as you can. But I didn't. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. You're not all the way back. In a close, in a tease. Yeah. Run straight forward. As fast as you can. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Me. I'm the gingerbread man. Dang God damn it, Riley. Are you you gotta. Yeah, you can jump. I'm gonna over go to bed. Thing. See you guys. Okay. Become low. Night, kitty. Yeah, if you Night, time kitty. it just right, and you get, and if you line up in the front gate just right, you can literally jump right over it. Well, before I do, um, there's also another thing. I was told there's uh, another heart piece around here. Okay. Fair enough. Motherfucker. So, <laughs> so I've been kind of split lately. What happened? What? So I recently decided. Up? No. But so that's I recently happened to it. God damn it! So Sorry. I recently decided I was gonna redesign the watermark for my photos, and I used um, runes. However, I don't know how to feel about it because on one hand. I used it to spell to basically spell out my photo name, like the, the name of the my accounts in runes. But at the same time, I'm feeling sh maybe I should have used it to use it, use the runes to whatever they actually God mean. God damn to it! What dang the it. symbol in a way? I don't know. I you feel don't very. Have to do it, Golden. It's just a funny little Easter egg that I found yeah. out. I don't know, I just feel very iffy about if I should do it like that. Okay, so how do I get out of here? You're supposed to jump over the fence. And you just said... Over. Not that... You can actually jump over the other fences. Oh, Look probably. over there on the side. See those areas? Jump over there. And... There you go! Yay! I and you're free! I'm free to do what I want! And by freeing Epona, you broke the curse that was trapped on Lon Lon Ranch. Yay. I don't Dead. know, I'm probably... Yeah, I'm probably just overthinking. <laughs> you notice that it's not so cloudy over there now. Mm -hmm. When you get near it. Yeah, that is kind of cool. Well, Do you guys I still need to find a heart piece. Yeah. yeah. If you were going to find a heart piece in the Lon Lon Ranch, you would have had to do that as a kid. You know uh. Alright, so I guess I have to go without it and still take on uh, Ganondorf Phantom. Mm. Phantom Ganon, yeah. What do you guys think? Am I overthinking this whole rune shit? For my uh, photo watermark thing. Well, actually, I don't know. Up, oh, it's already gone. <laughs> no, 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 no. All right. Now, what was that melody? No, come on. Trouble controlling this game, dude. Mm. All right. Oh, that feels so good on my back. <laughs> the heating yep. pad is helping me so much. You have no idea. You should get a massage. I can't. At least not now, anyway. <laughs> you know, my mother yeah. is asleep. Well, I met within the week or something like that. 
Yeah, but if it starts flaring up again, then I might have to see if I can get somebody to take care oh, of that. Oh, right. Do I actually have, um... Okay, get, get rid you of have... this. Yeah, you have one fairy. Yeah, get rid of the oh, Oh, you feel so good on my back. You have no idea. Someone did a tier list about the best recreations of SpongeBob creepypasta. Oh, good grief. There's literally like. There's literally a tier list of almost anything imaginable. That does remind me, Def. We still gotta yep. do a tier list of Linkin Park albums. Yes! I found one that has not only the main albums, but their EPs as well. Ooh, okay. That can definitely work. I think it's <laughs> safe to one. assume there's actually one album that'll actually legit make it to the bottom compared to everybody else's opinion. Oh, oh I think every, I think I can already imagine it. <laughs> that was when Linkin Park tried doing dubstep. Oh man, was that hot dar like garbage. Oh god, don't remind me of Recharged. Oh god, Recharged was terrible. <laughs> the day that never comes. Bow, 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 bow. <laughs> that was embarrassing. You, know, <laughs> you want? It kind of reminds me of when Korn, of all bands, tried to do dubstep with the Path oh. of Totality. Oh, which, somebody yeah. got triggered. <laughs> Who? No, I think Ryzen was just saying Korn because Korn! Korn! Yep. All right. Uh, so apparently, um, the Equestria guy has a question for Jesse. Yes. What is die question? Because <clears throat> I can't see the I can't see the thingy because my uh, I'm not on the the, the Twitter or the Twitch Twitter. whatever the Twitch chat. It's yeah, I'm not on, so you'll uh, you'll have to. Uh, oh damn it! No. You will have to tell me. Poke Jesse again. I can read it to you whenever um whenever it comes. Yeah. yeah thank you. That would be much appreciated. Yee. But um. Holy shit! I just took that guy down like nothing. Da -da 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 <laughs> oh god damn it! Get up. But yeah, Korn did a dubstep album called The Path of Totality, and no one really knew how to feel about it. It had Skrillex on it. Dude, like, like somebody did like some kind of dub redo of um, Papa Roach's Last Resort, and man, it's dog shit. Uh, the only time I ever felt that a band doing putting dubstep in their music was actually pretty like out of nowhere, but it worked, was um, three times. One was with Dead Mouse with the song Razor Weapon, where it was originally just a normal house song, and then there was a dubstep breakdown, which actually I pretty much enjoyed. Um, Muse did a dubstep song of all bands, and apparently it worked because they were using actual instruments instead of just simply doing a breakdown. And Cult of Luna had a song called Vicarious Atonement that had a dubstep breakdown but considering it was the third song off of their album vertical where it was the longest song on the record it was like 18 minutes i can't be angry for them for doing that it actually kind of felt necessary so right. the only time, the other only times i felt that dubstep worked don't worry question guy i'll read the question uh jesse i'm curious where did you see that you can jump over the gate easter egg um I remember seeing it back on YouTube, and the funny thing is, I actually tried it on my, when I was playing through the 3DS version of Ocarina of Time, and I was able to pull it off. Hmm. I've seen it long ago on YouTube, I I don't remember when, but I remember seeing it once on YouTube, I was like, wait, you can do that? So I tried it when I was playing it on, when I played the old one, and I was like, well, what do you know? It works. Ha! <laughs> it's it's really crazy. Especially if it's a remix of an original song. 
I remember the dubstep was like giant like throughout that decade. Like I remember living tombstone and wooden toaster were involved with that. Yeah, Skrillex was heavily Skrillex was very popular at the time for their dubs for his dubstep music. Although he kinda fell hard after dubstep. Have you seen of... what Skrillex looks like recently? Dude, it's so weird to see him without his signature emo hair. Like that's so I, weird. Uh, did you know? Did you ever hear that he was in a fucking screamo band? Hmm. He worked with Utada Hikaru for the intro to Kingdom Hearts three. At he this did. point, I'll believe anything. <laughs> yeah. With Skrillex. Yeah, he, he was in Wreck It Ralph. Oh my god. Yeah, he was in a screamo band too. He was the vocalist for a while. I mean. Actually, he was a he was the vocalist for like the first two albums, and he only recently returned back to them. It's like so weird to imagine that that seemed to be the case. <laughs> Skrillex is such a weird man, but I do not have anything again. But I have nothing but respect for him. Uh, so apparently I found some interesting information about uh, that song I mentioned before that drove me nuts. Uh, hey there, yeah. Delilah. So apparently, as Shuka mentioned, um, so it was based on when the lead singer found a lady that he thought was beautiful. And he literally told her that, hey, I already have a song with your name on it, even though he never wrote it yet. Hey there, Delilah. What's, What's it, like it like in New York, York City? City? I so, hear that song way too much. Yeah, it is. Like, she even stated at one point it's been driving her nuts. Yeah, it was apparently written for Delilah DiCrescenzo, um, who was a cross country runner. Yeah. <sighs> I just hated that it was just played on the radio so fucking much. It pissed me off. It it was so like now it just reminds me of my job yeah you know it's even what's even funnier is that is that literally it's not even the best representation of fucking um the playing white tees they're more pop they're more like a pop punk band and fucking freaking hey there delilah is just a pop it's just a fucking folk song oh wait i remember now I just remember the, um, the, uh, what's the one I'm looking for? The more lewd version of Hair There, Delilah. <laughs> oh, really? Ah, oh, fucking hell. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna tell Riley in the, um, not, I'm gonna tell Ryza in private what it is. <laughs> okay, so I got the right height, and... Oh, the link! Why did you switch to that? <laughs> you fucking numbskull! What? That's pretty funny, actually. <laughs> oh, damn it! I'm gonna send. I'm gonna send it to Riley now. <laughs> Monster. Oh. One other thing I was able to see when I was playing when the one when I played um, the 3DS version of Ocarina of Time for the first time, my first uh -huh. let's play playthrough of it, when I was fighting Phantom Ganon, he I was fighting him like I was fighting like Damn he it. expected Fuck. the whole time. However, he did a move I didn't know he could do. Well then, he basically charged after he got off his horse and one moment I was just getting ready for him to strike me with his energy balls next thing you know he freaking Finally. charges at me huh. like wait what the frick what 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 where did that come from what silly yum 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 also um <laughs> oh shit if you golden if you thought hey there Delilah was annoying you should have 
it got it gets even worse when my workplace plays um the song one two three four by them oh it's like the most saturated love song ever it's like one two three four as for you i, I like you. that song it's cute like it's fine but eh, when you hear it so played God. so many times at your Damn. workplace it gets tiring Plus, not to mention, I kept overhearing it, so instead of hearing one, two, three, four, I kept thinking it said one, two, three, wood. One, two, three, four, tell me. I can me just imagine that when that song more. is playing, it's like just, it's just white noise. It's just. Yeah, that's what a lot of music in my work becomes after a while, it's just white noise. Yeah. It's definitely white noise with, Hi there, Delilah, what's it like in New York City? A thousand girls in mm. Oh, that does remind me. Um, Death Force, I showed this to you. I shared. Uh, I also shared this in the uh, in the server. But uh, apparently, uh, somebody did an AI voice of Patrick doing Under the Bridge from Red Hot Chili Peppers. Oh, I remember that. <laughs> what Especially the, fuck? the part where he goes all falsetto. It sounds so weird. <laughs> and I don't know what oh, it want to be. Like I did that day. <laughs> uh, what? No oh, son of a bitch. I have to take care of them again. I'm also going to send you <laughs> the lewd version of Hey There, Delilah. Oh, God. <laughs> Hemi called and we're thinking the same thing. Is it? Hang on, I gotta take a look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey there, Delilah. Oh, what's it like in D? I'm just gonna stop there. <laughs> let, yeah, let, let, let's leave that alone. <laughs> yeah, because it's too bad that Twitch and YouTube can't grow a spine. Yeah. Also, when I went to see the Mario movie and Bowser first popped on screen, the first thing I said ah. was, um, a certain four-letter word, and my friend Josh just looked at me and shook his head in disapproval. <laughs> That's hilarious. I can't help Old it. Algebra. Bowser is hot. Really? Bowser is good-looking. Do you say Daddy. No, let me tell you what I said in DMs. Let me tell you what I said in DMs. Damn it. Now you got me curious. Okay, I'm going to tell you in DMs too, Jesse.